Shalom y'all, I'm over here, aka Mama Cheryl, coming to you with another video, live, no not for real, I'm just kidding, anyway, <laughs> I'm coming to you with this video because I watched a video that was done by Sister Nav of, of uh, Natsuri, wife and mother, and what her and her husband are doing, they are uh, remodeling a, a portable cabin. And she was talking about, you know, because they didn't have their heat source hooked up yet, how cold they were. And, uh, you know, she said they were sleeping in the clothes and they were, it was cold, extremely cold. But then, uh, one day last week, I was watching a video by Sister Kate from For God Live. And she was talking about how to prepare yourself when, you know, for the winter, you know, you wear your hats, your scarves around your neck to keep warm. Okay, my video is more or less for at night when you go to bed, dealing with uh, what Sister Nava and uh, uh, Brother Ian went through, being cold. Okay, I'm going to give you some tips that I learned, and I learned them when I was at Sukkot some years back. You know, because I was freezing <laughs> cold, and I was wondering why I was so cold. You know, but when I tell you what causes you to be cold... You're going to say, duh. Well, anyway, the thing that you do when you're cold, whether you're out camping or you're at home and you're having heat problems, the first thing you want to do is lose your sheets. Sheets, regular sheets, polyester blend sheets hold cold. You might think you're in bed, you know, all wrapped up and you feel like you say, why am I so cold? I'm still cold. Your sheets are holding cold because if, say for instance, if you're laying in, say, uh, okay, I'll say this. I had a queen size air mattress and I would be warm, but if I touched either side because I was in the middle, it would be cold. Okay. Thank goodness Coco, the dog, our dog, she thought she was here by herself, and when she came down and she heard me, she got so excited, she jumped on it, and it deflated. So now I got my old trusty cot that I use for Sukkot. New. New. Not old. New. It's an old trusty cot. Stay out of my video. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah, this one is new, but, you know, when I say old trusty cot, they know what I mean when I say that. Yeah. Because I do have another cot in there, but I prefer this particular brand. You know, the blue one that's in there? Oh, yeah. yeah. Okay, now, I'll use that one if I have company. Anyway, to stay warm, okay, first of all, I'm going to show you what we wear, okay? You should always, when it's cold, you have socks. You have something to cover your head because you want to keep your that heat in your body. All right, we sleep. This is thermals. This is one, you know, one pair of my thermals, which I sleep in my thermals, you know, and this guy has fleece on the opposite side. Fleece will always be warm. It never gets, I don't care how cold it gets, you will never feel the cold on fleece. I don't know why that is. That's why I love it so, okay? Now, as far as the bed is concerned, like I said, um, let me move, move uh, my pillows out the way so you can see. Okay, now, because you're going to lose your pillowcases too, you know, you're going to take your pillows out your pillowcase. Now, for some reason, the pillowcases will get cold, but this in the pillow won't be cold. It'll be cool, but it won't be cold. I like cool. Now, on the bed, okay, I sleep between these two blankets, okay? But if it's extremely cold... I will pull this blanket back and get on this. This, ooh, the cat's I gave to you. Yeah, this yeah. is a um, a mattress cover. Yeah. And the mattress cover is also like a fleecy material, and it stays warm. So if it's extremely cold, I will get between, get under both blankets. But I usually just sleep on top of this blanket. And like I said, I take the pillow off the pillowcase, and I'm pretty good. And I usually just fold this back because this. To touch this, it gets kind of cold, but not really bad. Yeah, like it's kind of cool. Yeah, so I fold that back. But then on the back. inside, it's warm. Yeah, I fold that back, okay? So, if you can, sleep between the blankets. Get rid of the sheets. Now, I have my sheet is on here, 
but it's underneath. Let's see. Yeah, you can see the gray sheet. She just used that because the uh, yeah. cot is kind of hard. Yeah. So. Well, no, I use it to keep warm. That keeps you warm. I'm getting an A-crate mattress to go on top of this. Anyway, that's what I wanted to share. You know, there are other ways that you keep warm. Not, like I said, we use the thermals. But the best things to wear when you're cold to sleep in on cold nights is a pair of good sweats. You get you a pair of sweats because you know when you turn sweats inside out, it's fleecy on the other side. So a good pair of sweats. Now, you do not have to spend a lot of money on blankets. You can go to a thrift store, get you some blankets, and if you got a washing dryer, wash it really good, and, and there you go. But if, And if you have a mattress cover already, just take it off the mattress and put it over the sheet. Yeah, and that way you will, you know, it'll help you keep warm. And you will be surprised at how much heat stays in your body when you do it that way. So, I just wanted to share those tips with you. You know, lose your sheets for the winter. You don't need them. You know, sleep between blankets because those blankets will hold your body heat in. And like I said, wear socks. Wear your head, wear something on your head, you know, pull your little beanie on and keep the body, your body heat, you know, yeah, keep your body heat, don't let, because the heat will go from the top of your head, and if your feet get cold, you're going to stay cold, so I hope these little tips will help somebody, uh, if you have any questions, just put them in the, in the uh, comments, and I will try to get back to you, so with that, I'm going to say thanks for watching. Uh, if you haven't subscribed, if you're the first time watching this and you haven't subscribed, subscribe. And to remember to get those notifications, hit that little bell so you'll get those videos. And uh, I'm going to also share uh, the, the two sisters that I mentioned. I'm going to share, you know, I'll put their links down in the, in the description. So with that, I'm going to say stay warm and shalom. Shalom.